amongst the most catastrophic years on record. The past year was bombarded by natural disasters. Events from volcanoes to hurricanes destroyed cities, crippled communities, and claimed lives globally. Residents of impacted areas are still struggling to rebuild their lives, but there are many ways to support these ravished places. Volunteering is an excellent way to help communities impacted by natural disasters. Opportunities to volunteer can be found by searching online and or joining a relief organization. Examples of relief organizations include the Red Cross, World Vision, and Salvation Army, but there are many more than just these. Many organizations may request volunteers to visit impacted areas or run shelters for victims. Volunteering is a great way to assist devastated areas, but many people have schedules that do not allow them to give away so much of their time. Fortunately, there are other ways to provide aid and assistance to recovering areas. An alternative option to volunteering is donating. Donations greatly aid areas affected by natural disasters by providing them with food, drinking water, and other necessities. When people donate, it helps citizens of devastated areas focus on rebuilding their lives and getting them back to normal. There are several ways to donate towards natural disaster relief efforts, but most are through organizations such as FEMA and the Red Cross. When it comes to donating, however, some donations can have helpful intentions but actually lead to harmful outcomes. Specifically, donating items people do not immediately need causes additional problems in their recovery efforts. Things like toys, clothes, and other non-necessities take up much space and do not help the victims recover. Furthermore, the cost to ship such items is high in price, and oftentimes, because they are abundant but useless, they end up being destroyed. It has been found that donating money is the most effective way to aid victims through donation. That said, make sure to donate directly to an official organization to ensure the money goes to a relief effort and not a third party. The second most helpful things to donate are shelf-stable foods and drinking water. These items are helpful to victims of natural disasters, but are more costly to ship than donations of money are to transfer. In summation, there are lots of ways to provide aid and assistance to areas affected by natural disasters. Either volunteering or donating is a kind way to support cities devastated by catastrophes and helps reduce the burden on those affected while recovering.